Peace be upon you. In this video, we present a scientific miracle of the Holy Quran, the creation of man from a drop of sperm. In 1677, the Dutch businessman and scientist Antony Philips van Leeuwenhoek, born 1632, died 1723, was the first scientist who observed sperm using his personally developed compound microscope. He imagined that each sperm represents a complete small-scale human. Modern embryology has confirmed that human fertilization requires the union of male sperm and a female egg. The fusion between sperm and an egg forms a new organism leading to a zygote and then an embryo. Furthermore, it is well known that only a very small percentage of sperm is used in the fertilization process. This small percentage is estimated at 3.33 times 10 to the power of minus 6% of the emitted sperm. This scientific fact was mentioned, more than 1,400 years ago, in the Holy Quran by describing the creation of man through a drop of sperm. Chapter 23, verses 12 and 13, And certainly we created man of an extract of clay, then we placed him as, a drop of, sperm in a place of rest firmly fixed. In this verse, the phrase a drop of indicates the small amount of sperm that is required to create a human being. Thank you for watching this video.